as the stock market bounces up and down. I was looking for different ways to invest. After the Enron debacle and the subprime mess, I am still skeptical about the market. How can one tell what a company is worth with all of this debt leveraging, reinsurance, derivatives, etc.? I like Microsoft with all of its cash, but the stock has not done well and it is difficult to tell what value Yahoo will add to the stock price. I do not invest in oil because I think oil companies have too much power in the world. I do not invest in defense contractors because I do not think it is ethical to make a profit off items which kill people. So I started looking at closed end funds. I started researching the funds by doing a Google search, of course. I found a nice list of funds on WSJ.com. As I scrolled down the list, I found some curiously high dividend rates. The fund symbol CRF had an 18% dividend rate. I like Google's charts the best, so I migrate to Google to investigate. As the chart shows, Less than a year ago the fund price was at 19 and now it is at 10. Also, the dividend has gone from 18 cents a month to 16 cents. Hum, I need to investigate more. I like Yahoo's information on the fund's assets, so I scroll over there. I first look at the current income statement which is a year old. It looks like the fund has netted income over the last three years which is positive. Next, I look at the balance sheet. Their assets have decreased in the last three years, although they are positive. Next, I look at the cash flow. It looks like they are losing cash each year. Hum, I wonder how they can lose cash, lose assets and still pay out such a large dividend. I still need more information. So I stroll over to ETFConnect.com to get the net asset value and the major holdings of the fund. ETF Connect shows a net asset value of $7.45 and a share price at $10.71. How can the share price be so high? when the results of the fund have not been that well? Hum. I spend a couple of minutes trying to find the website about the company, but cannot find one. I look at several more funds on the WSJ.com website. A lot of them are the same way. I do not understand what is going on with some of these funds. Why would someone pay for a fund whose price always falls? Did the parent companies forget about these funds after they got their initial investment? Did they short these funds on the IPO date? Please note, 
I found some good clothes and funds during my search. Please do your own research, as I am not a professional investor.